this reading, you will hear what are chemical compounds in cells. Our key concepts are what are elements in compounds, how is water important to the function of cells, and what are the main kinds of organic molecules in living things. Just as a review to us, an element is any substance that cannot be broken down into simpler substances. The smallest unit of an element is called an atom. The elements found in living things include carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, and nitrogen, phosphorus, and sulfur. When two or more elements combine chemically, they form a compound. The smallest unit of many compounds is called a molecule. Water is a compound made of hydrogen and oxygen. Most chemical reactions within cells could not take place without water. Water also helps cells keep their size and shape and keeps the temperature of cells from changing rapidly. Many of the compounds found in living things contain the element carbon. Most compounds that contain carbon are called organic compounds. Carbohydrates, proteins, lipids, and nucleic acids are important groups of organic compounds in living things. Compounds that do not contain the element carbon are called inorganic compounds. A carbohydrate is an energy-rich organic compound made of elements carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. Sugars and starches are examples of carbohydrates. Carbohydrates are important components of some cell parts, including cell walls and cell membranes. Fats, oils, and waxes are all lipids. Lipids are energy-rich organic compounds made of carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. Lipids contain more energy than carbohydrates. Cells store energy in lipids for later use. Proteins are large organic molecules made of carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, nitrogen, and in some cases, sulfur. Protein molecules are made up of smaller molecules called amino acids. Proteins make up much of the structure of cells. An enzyme is a type of protein that speeds up a chemical reaction in a living thing. Without enzymes, many chemical reactions that are necessary for life would either take too long or not occur at all. Nucleic acids are very long organic molecules made of carbon, oxygen, hydrogen, nitrogen, and phosphorus. Nucleic acids contain the instructions that cells need to carry out all the functions of life. There are two kinds of nucleic acids, DNA, which is deoxyribonucleic acid, so DNA, and RNA. So DNA is the genetic material that carries information about an organism that is passed from parent to offspring and directs all of the cell's functions. Ribonucleic acid, this is RNA. A, right, from back here, RNA. Ribonucleic acid, or RNA, plays an important role in the production of proteins. RNA is found in the cytoplasm as well as in the nucleus.